The radius of a circle is measured to be 5.6 centimetres, correct to the nearest millimetre. Find the upper and lower bounds for the area in centimetres squared. So here we've got a circle with a radius. This bit, the radius is the distance from the centre to the outside of the circle of 56 uh, millimetres. That's 5.6 centimetres in millimetres. Right, the lower bound for that would be 55.5 and the upper bound would be 56.5. So the radius can be anywhere between 55.5 up until 56.5. It's not equal to that, but that is the actual bound. Now we need to, as we want the area in centimetres squared, we need to convert these into centimetres. So it gives me 5.55 centimetres to 5.65 centimetres. Now the area of a circle is pi r squared. So the lower bound will be the area is equal to pi r squared, which is going to be pi times 5.55 squared. That's the lower bound for the length. And if we work that on our calculator, we're going to get 96.7689 centimetres squared. Now normally we would round this off correct to three significant figures, so that would be 96.8 centimetres squared, that's six, making that seven and eight. The upper bound, using a is equal to pi r squared, using this length here, will be pi times 5.65 squared, which actually gives me 100.2874 centimetres squared. With that rounded off to three centimetre figures, which would just be a hundred, so it'll be a hundred centimetres squared. You're advised in IGCSE to write down the full calculator value and then the rounded off version. Now this could be written as the area being between 96.8 centimetres squared to a hundred centimetres squared, correct to three significant figures. And the point of being accurate, this is actually quite a wide range, as we can see. So just a little small error in measurement can result in a big um, error in area. Okay, thank you very much for watching.